Beach that is located near the quarry and Doncaster station. It doesn't look like a very good place to rest. The whole train just disappeared. It's up. These traces were made by a carriage. Look. The vehicle pressed this stone into the ground. It would have been quite heavy. The distance between the tracks is about six feet, seven inches. The vehicle would have been heavy, as these tracks are quite deep. These traces are relatively fresh and were made by a large truck loaded with materials. The traces found at the disassembled shed near Evesham and at the lake were from the same vehicle. an advertisement for lake cruises. an abandoned gypsy caravan. This place was abandoned fairly recently. Observing the coastline and the moored boats, we are able to see that the lake's water level dropped. The lake has flooded the quarry. The dam was probably breached. a label with the name Las Zarpas. My search should be focused upon the name Las Zarpas.
Here it is. You'll find nothing interesting here, I'm afraid. The entire train has disappeared. It's a disaster.
Mines. This is interesting. It would be quite possible for someone to redirect the train towards the mines. Here are the mines' homes. They appear to be abandoned. This mine has completely collapsed, Holmes. It is curious, but to be truthful, I am not entirely surprised. It's difficult to follow you, Holmes. Someone removed these screws, most probably to take down the rails. A few feet of the rails have been dismantled. Hmm. This is an unusual kind of paper, stiff and dry. It was used for a specific purpose. Let us look inside. Sawdust. I am almost certain it is a... Watson, could you assist, please? Do you have your pistol? Good. Fire at this package. Dynamite.
This box must be the safe. Let's open it. The Mexican company Caracal and the Chilean Barcazas both want to buy the mines. I need more information. Perhaps Mycroft could help. Watson, it seems that both South American companies were involved in the purchase of the mine. The man at Doncaster who fled our approach, he smokes Mexican cigars. Perhaps... Yes, Watson. We should certainly speak with him. <laughs> 